Hello everyone! Today we're going to make a cranberry scones. We need all-purpose flour, cranberry, butter, sugar, baking powder, salt, whipping cream, milk, vanilla, and egg. So we're just going to put the flour, sugar, baking powder, and salt, and then sip it together. Okay, put that aside, mix it. Mix that one. Okay, next is the butter. This is, by the way, this is a cold butter. Mix it. Mix it until the butter incorporates, until there is a crumbly. I think it's better to mix it by hand. It's less noisy. So just mix the butter until it'll be like crumbly. Mix the butter, the butter is halfway mixed into it, you know. Okay, so it's crumbly now. The butter is mixed into the dry ingredients. So what we have to do is, in a separate bowl, put the whipping cream. The milk. Vanilla. And the egg. You just have to mix it. Before this mix, we're going to mix it into the dry ingredients. Okay, once this mix. You can, um, if it's too wet, you can add a little bit, like dust, some flour into it, and then transfer it into your working space. Okay. Okay, so I transferred the dough into the working space. And then we're gonna put our cranberries. Then we just mix it like that until it's good. Okay, so I knead it until I mix it well and then um, flatten it to shape like a disc 10 inches like wide and then we will divide it so that um, it will be easier to just bake it later. Divide into like eight portions. Okay, so I slice it. Preheat the oven already. We're gonna bake it for twenty to twenty-five minutes. Okay, see you in a bit. See you guys in a bit. Okay, once you're done patting, pat it with a little bit of milk. We're gonna ready to bake it. Okay, so we're gonna bake it for twenty to twenty-five minutes. Everyone, fresh from the oven. We're gonna drizzle it with our 
Icing sugar and lemon juice. I just place my glaze in a ziplock bag and then we're gonna cut the tip of it and drizzle it into our cones. There we go. There we go. Here's our cranberries counts. See you guys. Enjoy.